to Trader Joe's. And in California, at least where we are here, they have a bag fee, 10 cents each for a bag, which I think is actually a great policy because it really gives you incentive to buy your own bags, which we did. Uh, but we left them in my girlfriend's car and you know, I was just going through the motion, stopped by Trader Joe's and realized when I pulled up in the parking lot, I don't have any bags in my car. So I had to buy two bags. What's that? What the heck? What is this stuff in the backyard? Another ball? Where did this come from? We have a lemon tree, or more like a lemon bush. They have a lemon tree over there. You ready for a morning walk? I'm gonna put my shoes on first. I love these boots. They take a little bit to put on, but I really like them. Good morning is the same struggle with this doggy. Gotta get this. Harness on. There you go. Oh, you're pretty good today. Oh, yeah. For the door. Let me grab this ball real quick. I'll set it outside. I think that other one might have been back there already because it looks dirty like it's been sitting for a while. But this one looks. Uh, I think somebody from over there kicked it over, so I'm going to put it in the front yard. I think it was probably them. You can see a basketball hoop over there. So I just set it in the front. Didn't want to pick this up with my hand, but I also don't want to kick it across carpets. grass. A dog being in the grass can kill the grass and we got in trouble by one of the neighbors. That's not really a thing in Indianapolis. Well, I'm sure it is, but where we live, it's not right there. I think it's theirs. What a beautiful morning here in California. We got, like I was saying, we got in trouble for her peeing in somebody's yard, which I did not know was a problem. So we found this little area over here with no grass, and hopefully this isn't a problem. It's basically her one and only place that she can claim. Nice, big, beautiful palm trees. And nice grass that we won't kill. Right, Dizzy? I'm serious when I say it's like fall here in January. You see this tree? It's just shutting its leaves in January. We can do it. We can do it. Come on. She's getting super excited because she sees these dogs way up there, parallel big dogs. <laughs> well, everybody's a big dog compared to Tusi. Oh, yeah, buddy. Is that your favorite treat? Is that your favorite treat? You're gonna brush your teeth. You're gonna brush your teeth. Jim Tin. Oh yeah, that's what you want. You want a pee? I'll take a pee. Thanks, Dad. I support trails. Beautiful day here in sunny California. And I have decided to go for a little drive today because I'm worn out from my bike ride yesterday or the other day, depending on when I post this. It's a lovely beautiful day here. I'm gonna go on down to the Tower District and maybe cruise downtown Fresno. Let us do it. Uh, cruising on in here to the Tower District. Coming in from this direction at this time of day makes this area seem a lot nicer than my initial impressions. Impressions. Street headed southbound. Better turn right because it's a long way. Can't really see around this corner. Oh, I see a big box truck coming though.
area. Certainly a, uh, it's certainly a quiet Sunday morning in downtown Fresno. It's really pretty because of the sunshine. Kind of surprised to see like so many trees, I guess, taller trees.
trying to think of any other uh, big cities that has a train going through the middle. This, I would think this would cause quite the traffic back up. I know in Indianapolis there's trains that come through but they go over bridges or there's like a bridge over the train. This is the Fresno City Hall, and it's a very fancy, futuristic looking building that looks really different than just about everything else I've seen in Fresno. I want to go check out the Little Italy section of this town.
seems like a good place to kind of light up the tires a little bit maybe. He's missing a leg. Wheel hop. These bridges just make me want to punch the gas a little bit. Well, I think that's going to about conclude my drive of driving around Fresno. It's um, fine. I don't, I don't really know how to describe it, so form your own opinion. <laughs>